want to nurture our family more than all the other stuff na secondary pa sa priorities namin. And I think we both took that really seriously. Mm-hmm. Eh, guess that's why we're together, kasi yun talagang gusto namin. Oo. Yeah. Oh, oh. Magkaroon ng maayos sa pamilya, yung ganun. Parang iba-ibang stages, parang as babies, iba yung difficulty, iba yung challenge. Tapos when they're toddlers, iba yung challenge. Pag, pag preschool, pag mag-aaral, pag teenager, iba, iba, yung, iba, iba yung challenge. Okay. It's normal in life naman, even when they're married, they're, they're still gonna be a problem. You still be involved with their problems. You, you never stop them. becoming a parent. You never stop becoming a parent. Kahit na pinakawalan mo, nasa Canada na sila, di ba? My mom is, uh, uh, my mom is 85. Ganda when we mo. go out, let's say, lalabas kami dalawa, even with my kids. Hindi makakatulog mo mam ko, she'll wait for us at home. I would have to tell her, Mom, 57 na ako. Huwag mo nakihintayin sa bahay. You don't stop being a parent. Once you get married, once you have children, parang iba na yung focus ko. Na iba na yung focus ko. So, nag-full-time ka kaagad. Sabi, oh, oh. nabasa ko, sobra ka daw hands-on. Mm-hmm. Yes. Super. Super. Mm. Super. And we didn't have a yaya for them. Kami lahat. But we had help at home. No, but, we had um, kasambahay. Uh-uh. But they had nothing to do in terms of feeding them, nice. bathing them, they, they, they didn't dressing take care them of the kids. Uh-huh. Wala, wala sila. Kami yun. We did the pampers, we did the feeding them, we did bathing them. Nothing to do with the kids. Na- Kilabot. Kilabot. That's not true. That's not true. Really, during my generation, ang kilabot nun was sila Aga and Richard. Yun yun. And Gabby. De, kaya lang kasi, ito, ito ang dahilan ko, ba't siya nabansag ang kilabot ng Kulay Yala? Well, of course, ako original we know is Haji Alejandro. But then, at that time, in the 90s, um, he would have concert tours sa mga school. Di ba? Kolehiyala yung mga pinupuntahan niya. Siyempre, with him at his age, a pogi singer. Ayaw, nakakaganda. Nakakaganda talaga guli yung mga girls. I think so. Yeah. But he went through everything. Of course. I mean, my... Uh, yes, yes, yes. I even went to, ano, first singing gig ko. Actually, it wasn't a gig. Wala pa si Boya Bunda noon. Boya was my first manager. I was his first talent. And si Venny Saturno, who discovered me, uh, sa San Juan, he just wanted to see, okay, you sing this song at this bar. Let's see yung reaction ng mga tao. Hindi nga maalam ng place. It was called Chico's. It's a gay bar. Dari mo na puto siya ng Chico's? Kumata ka sa Chico's? Hindi nga ako mo nung magtagalog dun eh. So that was my first ever. So eh, syempre, oh my god, that was a gay bar. Hindi nga maalam ng mga. Eh, pero okay naman. Okay.